Who is Jackie Claxton? She's a local girl that has the power to teleport to different locations and different dimensions. Her goal is to save others that are in need of help. She has to fight evil forces that inhabit this world. She's a fictional character that has a fanfare impact within a small community on the island of Oahu and abroad. She is considered to be a superhero, but she's just an average person trying to lead a normal life. I'm Alexandra Roth, and here's what you need to know about the Jackie Claxton universe. Local indie director Jeff Katz wanted to create a character that could make an impact in the community. He wanted to create good versus evil stories that would incorporate this character. Jeff Katz had a deep admiration for pop culture, comic books, fantasy adventure films, science fiction, and religion. So he decided to create a character and a universe that could embody all of those elements. The original story premise started off like this. Jackie Claxton is a local girl that was given the power of teleportation by a renegade angel named Silencia. Jackie was able to teleport to save people that were in trouble or were going to be. She mainly used her teleportation power on the island of Oahu, but eventually she was able to teleport to other locations around the world. During her many adventures, she was taught by Silencia in hand-to-hand -hand combat and martial arts. She acquired knowledge from other angels and she got involved in preserving the sanctity of mankind. Jackie is part of a group called Insiders, which are people given special powers by angels to save human lives and battle evil forces. But Jackie had her enemies. Her main nemesis was Cadence Sorensen. Cadence has the power of mind manipulation and was given this power by her demon guardian, Halicia, who is the rival of Silencia. Jackie battled against Cadence to save people. Cadence wanted nothing more than to please Halicia and rule by her side by destroying people and wreaking havoc and destruction. Cadence is part of a group called Inducers, which are people given special powers by demons to carry out the task of evil deeds from assaulting or killing people to assisting the demons in world domination. Jackie wasn't alone in her fight against evil and saving people. She has her insider friends to help out from time to time. Melinda Martell has the power of telekinesis and Jalen Ramos has the power of pyrokinesis. Cadence has her inducer companions to help her. Riley Hensfield has the power of vulnerability and Darlena Zinner has the power to create blue blasts. It was through this premise that Jeff Katz was able to create written short stories and background biographies. After establishing the Jackie Claxton character, Jeff Katz decided to try her out on stage. In the fall of 2009, the character of Jackie Claxton was introduced on a local stage play called Dancing Between Heaven and Hell, produced by a local theater group called TAG, The Actors Group. This was a musical dance play that featured Miss Hawaii 2007, Ashley Layfield as Jackie Claxton. Then in 2012, Jeff Katz directed a local independent movie that would solidify the Jackie Claxton character and her universe. Jackie Claxton and the Battles from Beyond tells the story of Jackie Claxton trying to save a young girl and the universe. The movie premiered at the Ward Consolidated Theaters in 2013 and various venues in Honolulu. It slowly gained a small fan following due to the main character and the world she inhabited. That same year, Jackie Claxton was set to be on the theater stage again. The world of Jackie Claxton tells the story of the character of Jackie Claxton searching for her long-lost father with the help of her friends and battling evil enemies in the process. This was a stage production that ran for two weeks in the fall of 2013 through TAG, the actors group. But it didn't stop there. Jackie Claxton made an attempt to TV. The Abnormal Supernatural Life of Jackie Claxton was a short-lived TV series that was pitched to local and national public access stations in early 2014. The series had the character of Jackie Claxton doing a video blog of her life, her friends, her enemies, and her adventures on Oahu. 
By early 2014, a series of Jackie Claxton film shorts were created and posted on the web. The Jackie Claxton indie movie had also produced a couple of spin-off projects that were showcased online. The character of Silencia, Jackie's angel mentor, was the lead in a couple of web videos that told the story of a group of outcast angels that lived by their own rules, were shunned by their angel peers, and taunted by demons that wanted them to fall. The character of Halicia, Jackie's nemesis, was the lead in a couple of web videos that had her and her group of lady demons trying to obtain human souls. In these series of web videos, Jackie had a cousin named Mika who could banish monsters on Earth. There were web videos that showcased stories from other inciter and inducer characters, especially the characters of Melinda and Jalyn. What started as a small local indie movie had become something much bigger as Jackie Claxton started to gain a fan base. It was then that the Jackie Claxton universe, or the JCU, had begun. Alexandra Salles from Sao Paulo, Brazil, has been an avid Jackie Claxton fan, illustrating at least 86 pieces of fan art of the JCU. Jeff Katz has used his illustrations for promotional use to this day. At the same time, another illustrator from Brazil, Alvaro Brenes Rodriguez, has done his share of fan art for the JCU. Other illustrators from Oahu also started to follow by doing their own versions of characters. There have been local cosplayers that have put their spin on the characters in the JCU, from photo shoots to video clips. Jeff Katz was very flattered to see others in the community participating in this endeavor. From 2014 to 2015, the JCU was exhibited at different local comic conventions ranging from the Japanese Cultural Center to the Hawaii Convention Center. A new awareness for the JCU had been discovered and a new audience had emerged. In 2015, Jackie Claxton started to make an influence on the teen generation in Oahu and Jeff Katz decided to create an origin story for a young Jackie Claxton. Jackie Claxton Teen Teleporter was the story of Jackie Claxton in high school using her power of teleportation to help other teenagers with their problems. Mahealani Sims Talba, daughter of local comedian Augie T, portrayed Jackie. There were two film shorts completed in 2015, with one of them focusing on the topic of bullying.
The Jackie Claxton universe would not be complete without its share of fans. The JCU has a small fan base that is starting to grow each and every year. The fan base started off in Hawaii and reached Japan, the mainland, and Brazil. One special fan, which is one of the main reasons Jeff Katz has kept the JCU going, is Diana Garrigan. Diana took part in the JCU on stage and in web videos. She died in 2011 from cancer. She was 20 years old. In excerpts from her diary during her final days, she mentioned how the character of Jackie Claxton kept her smiling and alive. The movie Jackie Claxton and the Battles from Beyond was dedicated to Diana. And now comes the pinnacle of the Jackie Claxton universe, Claxton Fest. Claxton Fest started in 2015 and premiered at the Ward Consolidated Theatres. It's a film festival that showcases original short films and videos inspired by Jackie Claxton and her universe. The festival's goal is to give local filmmakers, production crews, and actors a chance to see their work on the big screen. To learn more about the characters of Jackie Claxton and her adventures, please visit the website. Also, check out the JCU on other web platforms and social media under the keyword Jackie Claxton. I'm Alexandra Roth. Thank you for watching.